never say what you're ready for now. You're not even ready for a game of ping pong. <laughs> You're incapable of saying what it is you're capable of. Where your relish lies, where you're sharp, excited, why you never are, why you never were capable of exercising a crisp and full-bodied appraisal buzzing possibilities of your buzzing brain cells. You often, I'll be frank, act as if you were dead. As if the Bulls Pond Road and that lovely ebony lady <laughs> never existed. As if our sporting and intellectual life never was. She was tired. She she sat down, she was tired. The, the journey, the rush hour, the weather it was unpredictable. She wore her woolen dress in the morning because it was chilly, but the day had totally changed. She cried. You jumped up like um oh what's it? Jack in the box. <laughs> held her hand, made her tea. A rare burst. Perhaps the change in the weather had gone to her head. We walked arm in arm through that thick long grass over the bridge. We sat outside that pub by the river. Yeah. <laughs> nah, pub was shut. Man. anyone <laughs> did, did you see anybody notice us <laughs> did you see anybody watching us <laughs> oh. Oh. I'll keep busy in the mind, and that's why I'm still sparky. Get it? I've got 100% more energy in me now than when I was 22. When I was 22, I slept for 24 hours a day. And when I was 24, I slept for 22 hours a day. Work out for yourself.
But now I'm I'm sparky at my peak. Up here, two thousand revolutions a second, every living hour of the day and night. I'm a front runner, right? My watchword is vigilance. <laughs> I'm way past mythologies now. I left them all behind. Coco, sleep, cats, rain, black girls, bosom pearls, literature, custard. You'll say I've been talking about nothing else all night, but can't you see, you bloody fool, that I can afford to do it? Can't you appreciate the irony? Even if you're too dim to catch the irony in the words themselves, the words that I have chosen quite scrupulously and with intent, you can't miss the irony in the tone of voice. What you are in fact witnessing is freedom. I no longer participate in holy ceremonies. The crap is cut 